Hello and thank you for attending another ECAO short how to video by Advanced Network Devices. This is Mike Kazemian, Product Manager for ECAO at Advanced Network Devices. And today we will be demonstrating uh, a new product within the ECAO Connect product suite, which is called ECAO Spectrum Analyzer. Uh, this is an application that will be uh, suitable for iPad and iPhone and also it requires Sidekick to operate. Once the software is loaded into the iPad or iPhone uh, as seen on the screen and Ikaho Sidekick is connected, users are able to troubleshoot just about any Wi-Fi network. Uh, the way the software would work is to have uh, basically five different tabs and parameters and we normally look for whatever is red. However, today we will be going through all the different tabs and what are the functionalities of each of these. Um, first one is the signal strength. You can see first of all the associated um, SSID and AP is visible in the upper portion. Sidekick is connected and user is having an Ekahal Connect license which is up and running. Uh, we click on the signal strength tab and we are able to see basically full information about the devices, the users, uh, all the APs and SSIDs that are visible, what we are associated with. Uh, we can see the channel detail, we can see signal to noise ratio and other parameters within the, uh, within the network. Uh, if we select any of these um, SSIDs, um, we can clearly see more information about uh, that specific SSID as you can see in this instance. We, we can see the uh, signal strength uh, for, for that specific uh, AP. We can see also um, the data information regarding signal to noise ratio, the channel that has been utilized, the data rates and spatial streams and so forth. This is not possible for just about any uh, access points that are or SSIDs that are here available. We can see for example, this is another example that we can see exactly what is going on with the uh, signal strain characteristics. Moreover, we can also see signal to noise ratio details and again we can see uh, the details of the SNR, the channel utilization and uh, basically how many other users are on that specific channel and the SNR variabilities. And if you scroll down, we can see the list of all other audible SSIDs and access points that are within the range. Uh, and at the same time, we can monitor both the 2.4 and 5 gigahertz radios. Uh, once we go to channel quality, we can see exactly what is going on individually on a 2.4 channel and we can see what is going on with the 5 GHz channel or we can have both of them superimposed on top of each other. What is notable here is the utilization that we can see also the spectral utilization. For example, we can see here on channel 1 the there are too many APs uh, within the network, however the utilization is low. But if we slide down the list we can clearly see 10% utilization, 12% utilization and once we click we can see the utilization details as well on that specific radio. Of course channel 9 there's nothing. We can go take a look at channel 11 for example and we can see that we have five SSID counts and radio count and then the noise level. So it is quite possible to see all the detailed information. Moreover, we can dig in further by selecting the spectrum analyzer and we can see the real data for spectrum uh, for both bands uh, 2.4 and also uh, 5 gigahertz in real time. It is noteworthy that if we change the rotation of the uh, device that we are using here, uh, we would be able to, from, from landscape to portrait, we are able to see both channels at the same window. That is quite possible as well. Uh, this concludes our demonstration of how Ikaho Spectrum Analyzer on, on iPad and iPhone uh, operates. Uh, I do thank you for attending this short how to video. Should you wish to uh, review all of our uh, other 
YouTube video channels, you can always visit our YouTube channel. Uh, please subscribe to this channel to see more information about the Wi-Fi uh, measurement tools.